we're going to be covering more special tests. These are going to be looking at some of the impingement tests as well as AC joint pathology. The first one that we're going to be looking at is the Hawkins-Kennedy test for subacromial impingement. This one is done with uh, bringing up the arm to about 90 degrees of flexion. You can bend the elbow and then you're essentially just going to internally rotate in this position. You'll see some modifications where they'll kind of really crank on the arm or start to bring it across. But if you get into this position and really internally rotate them, you're going to be looking for pain kind of generally across the anterior shoulder. And this is again a special test for subacromial impingement. Our other subacromial impingement test is Nears test, and this is where you internally rotate at the shoulder and bring them up into frontal flexion, looking again for that general anterior shoulder pain as you get towards the end ranges of frontal flexion. Our last test is for AC joint pathology towards the superior aspect of the shoulder. You're going to bring them into frontal flexion to about 90 degrees, and then just adduct horizontally across the body. This is also somewhat called the scarf test as the arm is making a scarf across the neck. It's important to note where their pain is in this position because this can also be positive in cases of rotator cuff tendinopathy or subacromial impingement. So you want to note if their pain is occurring right at the AC joint or if they're getting that interlateral or posterolateral pain with some of the other conditions. And so those are some of our special tests for the shoulder.